Hi friends, in this video we will see about simulation interview questions. What is simulation? To validate the patterns that were generated during ATPG simulation is required. So, to validate the patterns what we are generated in ATPG, so, the, so that we need simulation. Whenever we have unconnected internal cut points, we have we will do simulation. Next question, what do you mean by fault simulation in DFT terminology? Fault simulation consisting of simulating a circuit in the presence of fault, simulating circuit in the presence of fault. Comparing the fault simulation result with those of the fault free simulation of the same. Fault free simulation means good simulation, good, good circuit. Circuit simulated with the same applied test. So, both fault simulation circuit results and good simulation circuit results both we have comparing. There are several types of fault simulation techniques such as serial fault simulation, parallel fault simulation, detective fault simulation etc. we have. So, majorly we will use serial fault simulation, parallel fault simulation in DFT. What is the need of simulation? To overcome the limitations of ATPG tool, we need simulation. So, when you will do simulation, what for you have to do simulation? Whenever our design have unconnected select line, internal cut points, then tester can apply patterns on EDT channel. It can apply a value on a value on an internal Pesado port. Internal cut points have pattern fails on tester. So, in order to detect these kind of issues, we need simulation. Unconnected select line, internal cut points and uh, testers uh, requirement. So, we do simulation. How you will do simulation? What you observe in simulation? It will mention total number of test patterns that sorry it will mention total number of test patterns and it will give how many are match and how many are mismatched it will also give the where the mismatch compare occur okay so to find out the mismatches and where it is occur those things to find to observe we do simulation. Explain simulation flow. Mainly it involves three stages. First one compilation. In compilation we will read all files like uh, library file, test bench file, database file. So using vlog command and elaboration. In elaboration we will read the top model and validation we will apply patterns to stimulus and uh, we will find out expected simulated values are matching or not and mismatch occurs we will do the we will we will debug it will um, so it will find we will find out the so where it has happened so those things we will va validate in validation stage what are the simulation inputs and outputs simulation inputs library file netlist so correct one you have to take so mismatch occurs also because of uh, uh, netlist netlist is not uh, proper okay so next one test bench so test bench means pattern file so is it may be parallel pattern or serial pattern file so these three are inputs and outputs simulation log compilation log transcript so these are the output of simulation what is test bench it is a very large pattern file which is, which is input to the simulation. What are the simulation types and modes? So, there are two types of uh, simulations we have serial simulation, parallel simulation and modes, no timing simulation and uh, 
टाइमिंग सिमुलेशन सो नो टाइमिंग सिमुलेशन मीन्स ओनली लॉजिकल ऑपरेशन विल चेक इन टाइमिंग सिमुलेशन लॉजिकल प्लस डिले ऑपरेशन विल चेक and what did you do in simulation explain procedure difference between serial and parallel loading so these are the differences we have serial simulation and parallel simulation simulate the design in the presence of fault is called simulation simulating the design in the presence of fault is called simulation in serial simulation so uh, serially loading technique serial patterns will load serially or serial operation will happen so it takes a long time a long run time and uh, compatible at tester level compatible tester serial loading data so uh, tester level serial uh, serial patterns we will use serial simulation is difficult to debug and mismatches are reported at uh, input or output pins of the scan chain next it takes long time to debug so since it is very difficult uh, to debug that's what a long time long time to debug force keyword is will be uh, not available in test bench so coming to parallel simulation parallel loading technique and short run time since uh, parallel so so run time will be shorter not compatible at tester level tester uh, tester level tester serial loading data so tester level we will not use uh, parallel that parallel parallel uh, parallel pattern only we will use uh, serial pattern parallel simulation is easy to debug mismatches are reported at the failing flop itself so not at the scan chain it takes less time to debug force keyword will be available in the test bench okay so what is the difference between zero delay and unit delay so coming to the zero delay output of the gate will follow the input within no time so output of the gate so no it is without delay you can say without delay is the zero delay and uh, unit delay output of the gate will follow the input after unit delay some some unit time one one minute one second two seconds like that on some delay so this is the unit delay okay what are the mismatches in the timing and zero delay simulation you have faced so in zero delay simulation so netlist variation due to wrapper contain at uh, at and not presence at uh, simulation x versus in the netlist so these are the mismatches and coming to the timing there are drcs c3 c4 c6 c7 and w17 drcs library problems timing violations so timing violations are setup and hold violations shadow cell issue clock screw issues so these are the timing issues next so what is critical path false path multi cycle path so definition sometimes the uh, interviewer may be ask like freshers are one or two years two years experience candidates uh, they will ask one or two years experience candidates they may ask so what is critical path critical path it is a path between input and output with maximum delay in a circuit that is called critical path false path path it won't come in the actual situation is called false path path will not presence so that those paths are called false path multi cycle path which requires more than one clock cycle which requires which requires more than one clock cycle to complete due to high delay to big combo logic high delay to big combo logic that is called multi cycle path how will you take care of false and multi cycle path so we can load false and multi cycle path information into fast scan during atpg so we can load false and multi cycle path information into fast scan during atpg using read sdc command hence it plays x value in the fault location associated with the false and multi cycle paths false path and multi cycle path will be there so those if you want to trace so you have to do this okay what is tcd file sdc uh, df and sdc files 
so three files mainly dft engineer will work so tcd means uh, descent code description sometimes they, what is the tcd file so it consists it consists of sub blocks information tcd file has to be read during the dft insertion of top level okay next is sdf file standard delay format which contains net delay plus cell delays sdc file synopsis design constraints so sdc is a format used to specify the design intent including the timing power and area constraints for design sdc is tcl based this format is used by dc compiler so these are the three different uh, files next one what is setup time and hold time setup time the amount of time synchronous de input must be stable before active edge of the clock so here you can see so this is the d d d d d waveform and clock waveform if you see this is the clock waveform so this is the clock so this is this time up to here this time is setup time so you can take ts so remaining time will be td delay time okay so the amount of time synchronous d must be stable after the active edge of the clock after active edge of the clock that is called hold time okay next one what is setup time and hold time fixing how to fix setup time and hold time fixing so if you want to if you want to fix the setup time if you want to setup time issue so reduce the combo logic delay by minimizing number of logic levels splitting combinational logic so splitting the combinational logic implementing pipe lining and using double synchronizer using flip flops so these are the setup uh, time issues setup time setup time fixing solutions and um, next one hold time fixing how we will fix the hold time can be fixed can be fixing by adding delays on input port input port delay if you if you add hold time issues you can fix adjusting clock speed add buffer and downsize the sales so this are the mainly will do okay thank you remaining simulation interview questions we will see in next video thank you everyone